Okay, so today what we're going to do is do a sketch based on a Lego model. And I'm going to show you how to do the drawing in Microsoft OneNote using a stylus like this. And um, if you want, you can also do it on paper using regular isometric paper. OneNote allows you to import JPEGs and things like that of isometric paper so you can draw it directly on there. So here what we're going to see is how I'm using this stylus right here on a Windows tablet to draw in OneNote the Lego model that I've been building. So here's the first block. Here's the second block and I'm doing these in blue. And I'm going to add some more blocks now. And these are in green. So I'm trying to show the different stages of construction of the model. So I've got two green blocks in and a third block. Now I'm going to draw it. And you know, if you're making mistakes as you go along, that's totally fine. Use pencil. It's a fabulous way to do it. And if you make a mistake, no worries. You just draw um, over what your mistake was or you erase it and you start over again. So here's three different green blocks. I'm going to now add another uh, block as well. This one's going to be a red one. And I put it in back of the green ones. I'm going to put another layer on top. Now here's where things are going to start getting tricky because I drew the first layer and now I'm adding a second layer on top. So I'm going to have to erase some of my lines and that's okay. So again, with, uh, with these windows tablets, um, there's extra buttons for, um, doing erasing and undoing or else if you're doing it on paper, just use an eraser. And now I'm going to start drawing that next layer. And the thing to do most of the time when you're doing these drawings is to try and sketch the things that are in front first. So on the second layer, I'm starting with this um, green block that isn't blocked by anything else. It's not, um, there's nothing in front of it. And so that tends to be a good place to, uh, to draw. So here are my green blocks. And you can see I sketched over the lines a few times, and that's all right. And now I'm going to make those red blocks that are in, that are in back of the green blocks. Okay, just like this. So I have blue blocks, green blocks, and red blocks. And now I have one more block to add on. There you go. So this means I need to erase a few lines. It's all right. I can do that. That's pretty easy. There we go. And now I'm going to add that last block. Now, sometimes when you're drawing these things, it's good to shift the paper around. You can rotate the paper as you're drawing it. Um, it tends to be easier to draw your lines from top to bottom. There we go. So we've now got a completed drawing and I'm very happy with it. And just for, for a little bit of extra here, I'm going to fill in the blocks. You don't really have to do this, but sometimes to get a, a, a sense for a three dimensional object, coloring in the, um, the object is helpful. And you know, coloring books for adults is, is the latest in things. So, it's sort of like that. So again, in OneNote, or there's all sorts of other programs that you can you can use this with. Um, uh, this is entirely doable um, by coloring in, sketching, things like that. Now, if you have an iPad Pro or um, one of these other tablets, that's fabulous. You can do that. If you don't, if you've already got a Windows or Mac laptop that doesn't have touch functionality, if you want, you can go and get one of these um, bamboo Wacom tablet things. 
Um, they're USB devices and they come with their own stylus as well. And they're effectively just giant trackpads. And, um, and you can sketch on them as well. So it's like sketching on a, uh, here, let me see if I can get this on the camera. It's like sketching on a, uh, on a giant trackpad like this. So if you're a Mac user or a PC user that doesn't have a touch screen, that's another option for you is one of these um, trackpad type of tablets. And they're under, under about a hundred bucks. Okay, so there you have it. How to sketch an object um, using Lego representation um, as well.